Okay, so last week when I did my initial video on the Two Notes Opus, I made the statement that the 5150 was a little anemic, but it was nice. And I didn't want there to be any confusion. When I said a little anemic, I don't mean that it's bad or anything like that. <clears throat> it just isn't exactly 5150 level, but it's still really nice. And if you go in and if you mess with some of the extra settings, then you really, really see just how nice it is. So I'm gonna go into the uh, Two Notes remote and pull up the settings that I have and kind of show you guys a couple of things um, and how I got the sounds. And not saying that the sounds are amazing or anything, but it just shows you what you can do with it. So, so I set up two versions of the 5150. The one I have pulled up right now is a 5150 with six L6s, which is kind of your classic 5150 power tube. Um, I've got a little bit of a gate on it, as you can see right here. I've got some EQ and an enhancer. Um, <clears throat> and then I've got, again, I went with uh, these Rectifier 412 cabs. I've got a 57 and a 121. Um, and then let's see, here it is with. You see, like, it just catches the noise when I pull my hands off. Turn it off. I don't know if you can hear that, but there's a little bit of hiss. So, gate back on. The EQ down here, I just set it to something that sounded kind of good to me, but here it is with the EQ. And here it is without. with and without again and then we've got this enhancer down here where the EQ is kind of like a EQ pedal that you would have on your board this enhancer is I don't know the best way to put it maybe uh, it's it's just another type of EQ it adds kind of a, a presence uh, with the brilliance right here and you'll you'll hear it here's with the enhancer on and here's with it off. That time I tried to tried to turn it on kind of in the middle so you could hear it go from without to with the enhancer. You can change, uh, you know, the effects, uh, body thickness and brilliance. You just have to kind of listen to it to figure out what you like on there. And then you can also set a wet dry level for it, which I like, which means that I'm mostly getting right now, mostly the amp and I've got, I don't know, maybe what do I have? I have 40% of the enhancer kicked in. Now let's go to the EL34. Okay, so here's the second 5150 that I set up. This one has EL34s, which is another flavor 5150 you can get. And in my opinion, it's my favorite 5150, especially of the newer ones. But here's a sound. Just, just enough different that I think it, like you can use them both. Um, you use both types of power tubes and have almost two different sounding amps. Um, here's the EQ down here, here's with it on. And here's with it off. Uh, in my opinion, the EL34 version sounds better um, without the EQ than the 6L6 version sounded without the EQ. Um, but I think that EQ on both of them just takes it up a notch. Again, just a little bit of gate on there. And then here's the enhancer. Uh, here's with it. And hopefully you can hear when I turn that off. Here it is without it again. got this one set up you know different than the one on the 6L6 version because I mean it required something different this one is set at about 35% then cabs I have a orange 412 with a 57 and an orange 212 with a 57 okay 
So that is the 5150 from the Opus. Uh, they call it the Nifty 50, um, but it's a 5150. And I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of an example of a couple of the different sounds you can get. You can do so much with this pedal. Uh, I'm gonna keep doing these. Uh, so if there's any particular amp in here that you want to hear, any particular sound you wanna hear, just let me know. Uh, I hope you guys have a great week.